Well, with a hall like this one, um, which is very easily accessible, lots of parking, centre of the village, great village atmosphere, and lots of people know each other and encourage each other to come along to classes. It's well used, it's social, and it's not expensive. <laughs> to each other. They might not have known each other before but they recognise each other from the week before or previous weeks and something to talk about, something that connects them. So yeah, it's social as well. They would have met in the shop and the post office. And the lifeblood of the community would have been exchanged at these, these meetings. It's the way that village communities survived. It's the way that people got to know when other people were in need of something. We've set up Pilates and fit steps in Freckenham. And we're also setting up a strength and balance class, which is starting on Thursday, which I'm sure some of you have probably seen flyers and James been spreading the word all over the village, I think. Providing a taster is really, really useful because we get a, an overall picture of the different levels and the abilities. It's getting people involved, we're meeting new people, new people are seeing what we do at the hall and can come to other events. There's no point in having the hall sitting here empty, it's just great to have it being used. It's just nice something to do all together, isn't it? Yes. I come because I was doing something else here and I knew some of the people and it's got a friendly atmosphere. Would you miss it if it wasn't here? Yes. yes. Oh, God, oh yes. yeah. And word does spread quite quickly, you know, that uh, there might be something that someone else is interested in um, to come along to. So, yeah, I think bringing it to the villages is just a great idea.